Take out here to prophesy the downfall of America once again, which is coming real, real soon. So I suggest you people that are Israelites, people of Negro and Indian descent, Latino and descent, to get right with the Lord. But if not, destruction will be your next door neighbor. Destruction will be your companion. <laughs> and that's according to the scriptures. <laughs> Let me get you a scripture here. Oh, well, that's Paul. Oh, shit, I need my glasses. I can't even see a damn thing. <laughs> Read that again. again. Whoa. How long, ye simple ones, will ye love simplicity? That's all these people out here care about some simple ass bullshit, okay? Everybody, they, they on some weak shit. They, these people have no knowledge. Only thing they care about is uh, drinking, popping pills, stuff. All the men care about is playing video games. You know what I mean? Playing online video games. Rapping, making a rap CD, making some whack ass rap music. Nobody want to hear that shit, man. Yo, your mixtapes just play the fuck out, man. That shit is garbage. Garbage, what? Garbage. It's filth, man. America's filth. Everything you people are about is all filth. You're a bunch of filthy heathens. Keep on. Um, and the scorners delight in their scorning and fools hate knowledge. Oh, yeah, because the scorner love to come up here and talk shit when we read the Bible. When we out here on the streets teaching, we actually doing something that actually is actually meaningful, these people have a problem with it. They have a problem with us teaching the Bible and they get mad because we don't want to join in on their foolishness. You know what I'm saying? Right. Turn you at my reproof, behold. I will pour out my spirit unto you. I will make known my words unto you. So the Lord, he's going to make his words known to you. Right now he's making his words known to you by us coming out here teaching his word. Keep going. Because I have called, and he refused. That's right, the Lord out here calling right now with his prophets, and we the prophets, and we out here prophesying, and we out here prophesying the destruction of America, because soon America's going to be destroyed. Go ahead. I have stretched out my hand, and no man regarded. But ye have said it not, all my counsel and with none of my reproof. Right, because they don't, people they don't want to be corrected. When, when, that's why when you read the Bible, everybody got a problem with it. Every time you open the Bible and read the words of the Bible, it starts fighting. People get mad at you. They start talking shit. They start scoffing. All right. Keep going. I will also laugh at your calamity. So when the Lord starts jacking these people up, when the economy collapses, Okay, then the Lord's gonna laugh, God's gonna laugh at you. When there ain't no food in the stores, and when they cut, cut off the EBT, ain't no more food stamps, the Lord's gonna laugh at you. Okay, when there's cannibalism in the streets, and people get killed, and there's race wars, and you getting killed, the Lord's gonna laugh at you. We gonna laugh too. Right. Hey brother, uh, when they close these uh, free clinics. Yeah, when they yeah, when they shut down them clinics, you can't get your medication. And uh, like these women, they pussy on fire and your dick's on fire. The Lord's gonna laugh at you. Right, right. Cause they said, uh, what's that? They said over over half the United States is infected with venereal disease. Over half. Right. Over half the United States population got a goddamn venereal disease, an STD. And those on CDC statistics. Yeah, that's government statistics. You know. That's right. 
That's just a reported case. Yeah, because most people hide it. They too ashamed to go to the doctor. They're trying to find somebody on the streets to get mad stuff, you know. The black market. Now, we got all these diseases because we got all these faggots walking around. We got women uh, that having sex with a hundred different men. You know, so that's why we, all these diseases are spreading. Because of all these homosexuals and adulterers and adulteresses. Because America is like the modern day Sodom and Gomorrah. Okay? It's the land of filth. America is nothing but filth and trash. That's, right. That's all it is. That's right. Go ahead. Filthy abomination. I will laugh at your calamity. I will mock when your fear comes. So the Lord gonna laugh when y'all start getting jacked up. And when the police start beating the shit out of you and the riots break out, the Lord's gonna laugh at y'all, man. But ain't no job. There already ain't no jobs. Nobody got no money. Okay? And they gonna be cutting a lot more jobs. Soon all y'all gonna be out of work. When your fear cometh as desolation and your destruction cometh as a whirlwind, when distress and anguish cometh upon you, then shall they call upon me, but I will not answer. Yeah, so y'all y'all don't even give a, they don't even care about the Lord whatsoever. They ain't trying to do nothing right. They just won't be engaged in their foolishness and they, uh, in their foolery all day and their nonsense. So when, when the Lord starts jacking y'all up, okay, when, when you when you bitches, you getting raped and you getting murdered by some savages, or actually a lot of these men, they gonna get raped too. Okay, it's gonna get crazy. It's gonna get ugly out here, man. It's gonna be diseases. It's gonna be cannibalism. Yeah, there's a lot of thug faggots out there. A lot yeah, there of rough is. faggots. There rough is. Faggots. There's a bunch of rough faggots. They come up. They gonna rape. Just like you get raped in prison. Mm -hmm. they, they, it's gonna happen out here. There's millions of motherfuckers rotating in and out that prison. And these times, these close prison doors gonna just open. They gonna bust up out of that shit, man. It's gonna get chaotic. You're right. It's gonna get chaotic. It is. Yep. Chaotic. And you know what? We pray for this to happen to these wicked motherfuckers. Yeah, we do pray that. We pray that it happens. We do, man. You no. Know? They shall seek me early, but they shall not find me. <laughs> for that, they hated knowledge. Yeah, because y'all hate knowledge, so the Lord's gonna reject you. Since you hate knowledge, you know, you know, you just want to be a dumbass and you want to be a fool your whole life. The Lord's just gonna destroy you, okay? Fucking simple. Look at this thing right here. Yeah, cause like, especially these women, man. These women all—they're the number one people to reject knowledge. They don't want. They don't never watch the news. They don't know anything about politics. They they don't know nothing. They're totally lost. They don't know any. They don't know basic history. They don't know basic facts. Okay? They, they don't know a goddamn thing. Yeah, like, like I had a bitch tell me she thought Martin Luther King got assassinated in the damn 1980. Right. They, they don't even know when Martin Luther, Lucifer King lived. That's crazy. They, 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 they can't tell you what year he what, was living. That's a reason. Right. But they, they love to talk about how much they love MLK. Right, but they right. can't tell you when he lived. Got his plaque on the wall and shit. Got his picture. Don't don't know shit about it. Right next to you have right next to uh the season boys here. Yep. You know, you go to my mom and dad's crib. That's they got they got a little little plaque thing. It's like a little. I mean, it's some crazy shit. Oh, that shit sent that damn bitch back to my head. I'm like, what up? Oh, that shit. Like, huh? Back then, it was damn near black and white. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They had color TV. <laughs> <laughs> I think you're on that. Yeah. Thing. Hey man, I was doing some shit on the, I was doing some research with Martin Luther King the other day. Yeah, Spirit yeah, hit me. We were going go up under that motherfucker. That nigga was a faggot, man. Yeah, Martin Luther King was a fucking yeah, faggot, man. He was a faggot. You know, Michael Mess bugged out there as he put them on blast. Yep. Yeah. But all his all his associates were homosexuals. All of Martin Luther King's associates were fucking homosexuals. He was a homosexual. All of them. One dude was locked up in prison for some bad acts. Look, and anybody you see on TV and the television's telling you he's a great hero, <laughs> that is the devil, man. Don't listen to nothing that TV tells you. It's the complete opposite. Yes, yeah, the anything they say, just believe the opposite. <laughs> right. <laughs> anything they consistently push. That, that's what. Right. That's why they always push and try to say uh, Gandhi is a great hero. You know, Gandhi, you supposed to look up at him. He's a goddamn Hindu, a fucking heathen. Or oh, America is freedom, represent freedom. Oh yeah, America don't represent freedom. How can a country uh, build upon slavery 
represent freedom. That don't make no goddamn sense. That's the dumbest shit I've ever heard in my life. It makes no sense. Right. The place with the largest population in the prisons in the world. Yeah, yeah, that's true. America has more prisons than the rest of the world combined. Combined. And y'all talking about you free. Here it is, the government spying on you. Every last text message you send somebody, or every last phone call you make get recorded. Y'all think you free. You a bunch of dumbass people. Y'all, they all a bunch of dumbass heathens, man. A bunch of, a bunch of retards, man. For that, they hated knowledge and did not choose the fear of the Lord. These people out here, they don't fear the Most High. If they fear the Most High, uh, the women wouldn't be walking around half naked. All the women wearing some tight ass pants. You can see it, they titties. They don't fear the Lord. They, all these women walk around looking like goddamn whores. Oh, uh, go ahead. They would none of my counsel. They despise all my recruits. Therefore shall they eat of the fruit of their own way and be filled with their own devices. For the turning away of the simple shall slay them and the prosperity of fools shall destroy them. But whoso hearkeneth unto me shall dwell safely and shall be quiet from fear of evil. Get some Jeremiah 5 and 3. O Lord, are not thy eyes upon the truth. Thou hast stricken them, but they have not grieved. Thou hast consumed them, but they have refused to receive correction. They have made their faces harder than a rock. They have refused to return. Yeah, and they all, everybody always complaining about why they so poor. They can't ever get on top. That's because y'all a bunch of, y'all wicked as can be, man. Y'all a bunch of adulterers. No, none of y'all know any of the commandments of the Most High, okay? If the Lord is the farthest thing from your mind and you wonder why you got it so bad. Therefore I said, surely these are poor. They are foolish. For they know not the way of the Lord nor the judgment of their God. Yeah, half these people, they eat goddamn pork. They parents, they, par they feeding their children pork. And the Bible says you ain't supposed to eat no swine. All y'all celebrating Christmas, celebrating Easter. When the, the Bible, nowhere in the Bible does it say to celebrate Christmas. All right, Christmas is the high holy, uh, unholy day of Satan. That's like the most satanic day of the year is some goddamn Christmas. Okay, Christmas is nowhere in the Bible, okay? Easter is not in the Bible. That's all paganism. But all y'all celebrate Easter, you celebrate Christmas, you feed your children pork. That's why the Lord's gonna destroy you. Keep going. I will get me unto the great men and will speak unto them. For they have known the way of the Lord. Jeremiah 5 and 4. Therefore I said, surely these are poor. They are foolish, for they know not the way of the Lord nor the judgment of their God. I will get me unto the great men and will speak unto them, for they have known the way of the Lord and the judgment of their God. But these have altogether broken the yoke and burst the bonds. Wherefore a lion out of the forest shall slay them, and a wolf of the evening shall spoil them. A leopard shall watch over their cities. Every one that goes out thence shall be torn in pieces. Because their transgression are many and their backslidings are increased. Yeah, their backslidings increase. They, they, they don't get better, they get worse. With each little generation of bastards, you get some, the bastards, these little, the little children, they get worse and worse, man. You see how bad these little kids are, they'll curse you out. A little five year old kid will be on a tricycle, will curse you out, man. They got no respect for their elders. People got no respect for their parents. All the women are whores. They teach their daughters to be whores. All these women have all kind of abortions. Go ahead with that. Go on ahead. Jeremiah 5 and 7. How shall I pardon thee for this? Thy children have forsaken me and sworn by them that are no gods. When I had fed them to the full, they then committed adultery and assembled themselves by troops in the harlot houses. The harlot, hey, hey, those churches, 
Yeah. In neighborhood church, that's a heartland house. Okay, because they ain't teaching no kind of truth, man. These yo, your neighborhood preacher does not know the Bible. They teaching them but lies, they just taking your money. Well, this is your reward for refusing the, 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 the Lord. You know? Like the scripture said, lions and wolves. Yeah. Like, like, that, uh, like that one scripture when uh, he prayed, he cursed the little kids out. Well, he sent the bears on there. Yeah, yeah. And it, ball, ball little kids. Yeah, that ball. was uh, Elijah's Elisha. Yeah, Elisha. Hey, it's laughing at because he was bald. Yeah, he, I think he was at, he just got here this morning. Yeah, morning. Yeah, yeah for Elijah because Elijah got beat up. Got beat up that was like, his best friend. Right. Concentrate with them demons over there by me, man. I'm so I'm glad they're gone. Well, they heard the way she yeah. so, you know. They just, I just, they sound like demons over there, man. Like, they were demons. They were fucking monsters. Like, you gotta, you gotta keep your eye on these motherfuckers, man. Monsters. Straight up monsters, man. They sound horrible. They just a foul spirit was on them. Foul ass spirit. <laughs> right, right. That bitch was over there puking. Right. She's over there throwing up and shit. That's probably the word. We was out here reading the Bible. That probably made her get sick. Yeah, yeah. You know that shit be like kryptonite. He's over there, there puking up all kind of pork chunks. You know what I mean? <laughs> that bitch was fat as hell. And she know she's eating hot dogs and bologna. That's all she eats. All kind of swine. Right? All kind of sausages. Good. That's why a lot of these bitches stink, man. They all eat pork. And that's why you get all these fat bitches out here. There's an epidemic of fat bitches in America. It's their diet. All right, I just seen a story in the news today. I just it said the obese women in America only get one hour of exercise per year. Damn. Damn. And that's just probably just them walking around the grocery store and shit. Yeah, walking. That's her, that's her exercise. Awesome. Yeah. <laughs> No, I see on one of them electric wheelchairs in the grocery store. Yeah, you see fat bitches on them things too. They got more, <laughs> you go to the grocery store, they got more electric chairs than ever. Yeah, they do, yeah. <laughs> it's, uh, soon it's gonna be like, uh, you see that movie uh, with that little robot, was a Wally? Yeah, yeah, that's that, it. Had all the fat people that's in the it, chair. Yeah, it was all in wheelchairs, yeah. 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 Everybody was all fat. Yep. That's yeah. how these fat bitches are right here, man. That's where the society's and then, and then these fat bitches is all fat. All these, you got all these fat bitches. They be wearing all these tight pants, thinking they still sexy. Think they think. They, they be on the internet talking about they sexy. And then, then they got the nerve to charge your ass if you want some pussy. They actually think they gonna get some money for that. These nasty bitches. These goddamn hoes are something else. Big <laughs> deal. Oh, yeah, that's that BBW. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, when that's on every goddamn uh, all over the internet, man, they, I mean, they think of you. They're, you know, they're brainwashed thinking they're beautiful, man. And that's some gross shit, man. You smell, a, you smell these bitches, man. Yeah, I don't know how you bitches clean that big ass of yours. They don't clean it. You know what I'm they, can't they, can't, they can't even reach their ass to wipe their ass after they take a shit. Yes. Get under their belly, right? Right, and they don't take baths, they take showers. And the woman's supposed to be laying in that water, man. And that's some funky shit, man. Bitch don't take a, a, a bath. You know they be having big ass dookie streaks up in their underwear? Oh, yeah. oh man. I'm just, I, I'm just saying, you gotta bring it out, man. I know. I'm, I'm gonna bring out the truth. I know. So you can understand how nasty these hoes are, man. I Because if it, these women, if they follow the laws of the Bible, they did, did not eat pork. First of all, if you don't eat pork, chances are you ain't gonna get that fat. Unless you just eat a lot, you know what I mean? And some people just big though, I understand that. Some people just made big. But a lot of you bitches, they, you just fat because you eating all that pork and all that swine and all these unlawful foods. Eat uh, catfish and shrimp. And fat bitches love some shrimp. They want you to take them out to dinner, get some shrimp, some, squirt, some shrimp cocktails some and some lobster. And then all these fat bitches, they have like 20 pounds of uh, shit stuck inside of their intestines. And they all clogged up. And they, you know, they they eating all this pork and it just stays stays in the intestines for months and it builds up. That's disgusting. 
some case of you, some case of you. That's disgusting. Now nobody wants to lay down with a bitch like that, man. Right, <laughs> this thing of a little baby that has to grow up inside that womb. You get a fat bitch pregnant, and then she's feeding a little baby pork while he's up in that nasty stomach. Ooh, that's gotta be hell for that little baby, man. Little baby come out fat. You know, just born with obesity. That's some shit. Hey, that's an abomination, man. You don't see no fat people over there in other countries like Japan, except for the sumo wrestlers. That's it. Yeah, they they, they get fat on purpose just for that. So, so there's no goddamn excuse for this shit, man. And then you got weirdos everywhere. Everywhere it looks a fucking weirdo. And you get tired of looking at weird people, man. These people, everywhere he looks a goddamn weirdo. All the men look like fairies and shit. They're all fucking faggoty. They're all, they got all this faggot, effeminate spirit on them. Mm -hmm. you, you just want to clothesline them. You know what I'm saying? Hit them, man. Scripture, you ain't read you got anything, I'll read this. First Thessalonians 5 and 1. But of the times of the uh, sea sons, brethren, ye have no need. I'm retarded. Let me read that again. But of the times and the seasons, brethren, ye have no need that I write unto you. For yourselves know perfectly that the day the Lord so cometh as a thief in the night. For when they shall say peace and safety, then sudden destruction cometh upon them. Right. It's like all these fat women. They they up there on their couch every night living comfortably. They, they don't think nothing's gonna happen. They they got a they ain't got a goddamn clue. So so when something when that destruction comes, they gonna get fucked up, man. Right. Sitting on the couch eating they swine. Eating that swine, Pepperoni, yeah. Pepperoni sausage pizza. All that sausage pizza. Yeah, don't order a pizza. They got five different animals on. Them. Right. You got pork and pepperoni. Pepperoni and sausage. Yeah, pepperoni and sausage and, and, and chicken and ham. <laughs> no, man, that's filth, man. That's crazy, and, man. Yeah, y'all, yeah, the pork, pork, the smell of pork even smell like the devil. Here you go. Leviticus 11 and 7. And the swan, though he divideth the hoof and be cloven-footed, yet he cheweth not the cud, he is unclean to you. So... Eat swine is unclean. You know the Bible says don't eat pork. Y'all don't follow the Bible, do you? Y'all probably agnostics or atheists. You know what I'm saying? Go ahead. Of their flesh shall ye not cut eat, and their carcass shall ye not touch. So that, that proves America's the kingdom of Satan, because pork is the number one selling meat over here. The, the, the most popular food in America is a pepperoni pizza or a bacon cheeseburger. Bacon cheeseburger. Hey, that's filth. That's some shit. A, a bacon cheeseburger. That's a goddamn abomination. Mm, mm, mm. They are unclean to you. That's unclean. Like they care anyway. These people gonna go. They're gonna go out just being wicked, man. They can care fucking less. Oh yeah, that's why everybody on my dad's side of the family, most of them, they dropped dead by the age of 50 from heart attack. All they want to eat is some goddamn pork. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Shit, my whole goddamn family, man. They got heart disease. That's from eating on that swan. Strokes, heart attacks. You know? My sister, she ain't number 40. 42, she done had two strokes already. You know, all that money was saved. That's not helpful either. You know? that's, that's how a lot of these bitches get so fat, because they got good jobs. Right. That money, all that money you make don't help you if you ain't got the sense enough how to spend it, right? They eating up their paycheck. <laughs> yeah, right. A gluten. What's what? that? A gluten? A glutton? A glutton. Right. Yeah, some people are heroin addicts. Some people are addicted to food. Mm -hmm. Seven yeah, deadly sins. Yeah. Seven. Be all seven. Bed oh, yeah. The bed ready and shit. I can't even get out the fucking bed, man. An I, hour I, of exercise a year? Like man, that's that, so fucking amazing. Man. Like that bitch on was eating Gilbert Grape. Oh yeah. Yeah, with me and all the cap rip. Yeah, big fat ass. Yeah. You really got people like that. Yeah, cause I'm I knew this big girl man. And they, and they said that the word fat ass so so called made it seem like she was giving fat people inspiration. Okay. Yeah, I knew this big girl man. I I, I was about to go walk walking. Well, I was about to go running. She's 
like, I'm going with you. I need to start exercising yeah. myself, man. This bitch after like about after that, I think 200 yards, she was ready to just go to take a she was ready to take a nap right in it. Yeah. Right she ain't break her two, ankle. It was, I don't even think it was 200 yards. Right she ain't sprain her ankle or break yeah. her leg. <laughs> well she got bad feet, bad ankles and feet from being overweight. Yeah, Her feet are falling in. Yep, that's how it happens. Yep, yep. Yep. And the, Look uh, at all these fat. When you be driving down the street, you see fat bitches. That bitches walking like they walk like this. <laughs> they walk. Yeah, they wobble. Right? Look like you got like penguins. Yeah. <laughs> Nasty bitches. They ain't got the nerve to get in the little ass lunchbox car. Mm. Right. There's a lot of these nasty men, they quick to give them hoes too. Oh, you got more than that? It's a hustle for them. Oh, that, is, oh, that is a hustle. Well, these big bitches need love that's too. What, yeah, that's what, yeah, that's what you do with a fat bitch right you use them. What else are you going to do with them? You can't make sweet love with them. You got to use them. They don't mind being used anyway. Yeah, you got to use all these hoes. Yeah, they don't mind being used. This one bitch I know in Zanesville, she said, man, I pay, I pay you every... I, I give you money, I pay you every day to come down here to see me. Yeah. Big this, a big cute white girl. Yeah. Cute girl. Cute stuff. Yeah. So they ain't working. Big bitch. You get one of them bitch bitch. Yeah, I was just about to say it's a good one. I don't know how we're gonna talk about this. Call her. Isaiah. Isaiah 32 and 9. Rise up, ye women that are at ease. That's right, that's my charm right there. Hear my voice, <laughs> ye careless daughters. Hey, these women ain't gonna hear the voice of the Lord. You got, it ain't gonna happen. Yeah, yeah. Give but, ear unto my speech. Hey, ain't like we gonna go out here and teach the Bible. We're gonna read some scriptures, and all these women, they're gonna wake up. Right. You know what I'm saying? Man, these bitches are gonna stay being hoes. Because they, they're not gonna do nothing until the men, uh, they get us so what's in. Okay, I finished that, then we get Song to what? 110. Uh, Isaiah 32 and 10. Many days and years shall ye be troubled, ye careless women, for the vintage shall fail. The gathering shall not come. Triple ye women that are at ease, be troubled, ye careless ones, strip you and make you bear. And Sackcloth upon your voice. Yeah, so, so that's why you got all these hoes. All, all these women is all hoes. That's why we call them bitches and hoes. You know, we don't see us call, call out here calling hoes women too much. We refer to them as bitches and hoes, whores, tricks, sluts. Because look at, yeah, they shameless. They walk around some uh, uh, half goddamn naked. Every last woman you can see her titties. You know what I'm saying? You can see a pussy, camel toe. You can see their butt cheeks. They got tattoos on their titties. And, and, when, and none of them got their head covered. They all loud. They all disorderly. Mm. They all done been with a thousand different men. Mm. They're a bunch of goddamn whores. Mm. It's amazing, man. And they tolerate this shit. Yeah, it's tight. Yeah, right? You said it's legal to commit adultery. It's actually, what's well, legal to worship the devil, too? So what do you expect? I've seen that damn church in Satan too. It's all clean on the outside and shit. It's all clean. Like they can make this up on this one. Ain't no goddamn. They got a lot of money. Ain't no shit spray painting on there talking about get out of Satan and that shit. Ain't nobody putting their boycotting or nothing. Oh, nobody's boycotting the church of Satan. Yeah, there ain't nobody out there boycotting the church of Satan. They, they, they make a lot of money. They probably make more money than a regular church. You know what I mean? They, it's the only Satan. damn house, too, on the strip that's black. Over there in California. Oh, yeah, it's in San Francisco? Yeah. The only house on that strip that's black. Well, plus, you got Freemason temples everywhere. They ain't got windows, either. They ain't never do uh, worshiping the devil in secret. Hey, you got more than that What you about to read? Oh, you want Psalms 110? Oh, yeah. Start at 1. The Lord sent unto my Lord, sit thou at my right hand. That's how I make thy enemies thy footstool. So yeah, the Lord, so that's talking about when the Lord comes back, because right now, the Lord's on the right-hand side of the Most High. Keep going. The Lord shall send the rod of thy strength out of Zion. Rule thou in the midst of thy enemies. Thy people shall be willing in the day of thy power. 
Yeah, so the people shall be willing and a damn by power base. So these hoes ain't gonna get in order until we get in order when the Lord gives us our power. So they ain't no, don't be out there thinking you're gonna wake up a woman, come I got a righteous woman. Ain't no such thing as a righteous woman, all right? Ain't no such thing as a woman waking up to the truth. Because most of these bitches will find out they're Israelites, they try to correct you. Hell they be man. all up on the comment boards, on the videos. Yeah, 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 Sound man. Sounding dumb as hell. Going off all like a motherfucker. All what those bitches do, don't go online and motherfucking talk to some other nigga mm -hmm. to go around scripture and see what that wicked ass motherfucker had to say about it. Yeah. To go yeah. around it. You got a husband at home. Yeah, you ain't got a husband that fucking home. Don't yeah. go around the whole motherfucking thing, man. Nah, let me go to this man. Don't know from a can of fucking paint. Right, right, right. And it'd be a wicked nigga she's so sorry. That's what I'm saying. Right, it'd be a wicked ass nigga. Because first of all, you ain't supposed to be talking to somebody's wife in the first place. No. I don't even want to say hi to somebody's wife. I don't want to see him say hi. You know? Yeah, but you got some guys on YouTube that claim all. Oh, yeah, especially the faggot ass Christian. All these so-called Christians, they all got women on YouTube teaching. They got women preaching. They got lesbian preachers. Now, I, I know of a church that's that has a lesbian preacher right church. down there on Broad Street. Yeah. Yeah. A, le a goddamn lesbian is their preacher. Not when the Bible said a woman ain't supposed to teach at all. A woman shall a woman shall not assert authority over the man. That's right. I'm gonna get that scripture. The bitch is supposed to be learning in silence. It's been a while since we talked about it. That things. means, right, that means have your motherfucking mouth shut. Cause oh, they, gotta, you know, anybody gotta, with sis ain't nice. supposed to be listening to a woman in the first place. Cause nice. ain't nothing you can say to enlighten the man of the Lord. Ain't not a goddamn thing you can say to enlighten the man of the Lord. Wicked ass goddamn women that get birth to these wicked ass people. Open your legs and be full of legs, ain't nothing but fuck. Ain't nothing but stick. <laughs> And a man who still go down, these wicked niggas still go down and eat these bitches pussy, man. This is uh, Proverbs 5 and 1. My son, attend unto my wisdom, and bow thy ears to my understanding, that thou mayest regard direction, and that thy lips may keep knowledge. For the lips of a strange woman drop as an honeycomb, and her mouth is, is smoother than oil. Yeah, she'll put your ass to sleep and listen to these bitches. Whisper sweet nothings in your motherfucking ear, draw your ass right to sleep. I mean, we witness brothers fall out this truth because of a wicked ass bitch, you know? Oh, bitch. And we seen it coming. You, you know, know, a bitch will play that game, they'll start crying on you, mm -hmm. try yeah, to get your right, money, yeah. right. make you feel sorry for them. But her end is bitter as wormwood. Woo, goddamn. Sharp as a two edged sword. That's right, that's right, that's right. Her feet go down to death. Oh, she's looking to destroy your ass. You know, she'll take her own self out to take you with you. Take you with you, with her. What's up, homie? Mm. Get you got the spirit on you today? I bet, well, I bet. Huh? Well, let God, be, well, let God be the judge. I pray. I get, into his, I get into his word. And it's slapped, it's slapped into my feet, so it's not the best I can do. Yeah, you're, you're right about that. Well, even my food is good. You know you know, you know, you see, you know, you see the feet of right? Yeah, I can't hurt. Not enough. You know you need a mic? You do? How do you know? I don't know. You know your spirit. Your spirit. Are you an Israelite? No. You know the Israelite? You're not an Israelite. So if you're not an Israelite, what are you? A heathen? Mm. Are you a heathen? Yeah, he is in town. You call it Asian, right? Ah, ah, he's an Israelite. Okay. <laughs> 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 ain't no you such thing. Know, right, ain't no such thing as Ain't no such thing as black as you like. Okay, Satan. He reminds okay, me of Penguin. Yeah, it <laughs> do. The penguin with that damn hat. That is the penguin. That is the penguin. Yeah, oh, he's got an umbrella too. <laughs> <laughs> How's he go? Wah, wah, wah. That's what it sounds like. Oh, God, I meant to tell you. Um, the new cartoon is out. What's that? Uh, uh, Justice League War. I ain't seen This shit is dope. That, uh, it's dope. Uh, you can download it now. Um, oh, it's a movie? Mm -hmm. It's a movie. It's back. It's dope. You're going to like this one, too. You're going to really like this one. So you got to download that shit while we still got the internet. <laughs> yeah. 
We ain't got much time. All this shit going on. All this chaos and riots every fucking where. They trying to sh they trying to shut all the tourists like that. All the tourists like. There's one I can't even get on no more. I used to get on. Uh, they probably changed the address. Here you go to it. This city's been shut down. <laughs> oh, I know BT Junkie got shut down. I used to watch every movie on this site too, man. Everything. I just used the pirate bay all day. Yeah, it's going. It's time running short, man. Yeah, it's running short. Download everything while you, you still can. Time's running short. You know. These people, they gonna shit themselves too when they shut down the internet. Right, right. It, it, Cause soon they gonna make it hard for you to upload videos. You ain't gonna be able to upload videos forever like this. Start uploading shit. They gonna come knock on your door. Come on, put your handcuffs on. Turn around. Yep. And to lock your ass up. All kind of shipping overseas like that. You know? they, they don't like the, the fact there's all kind of people on YouTube put uh, videos up spreading truth. Right. The last thing the government wants is people spreading truth, man. They don't want to see that. Because we're, we're a threat to them, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, ain't right. nothing they can do that can reverse this, turn it back anyway. Oh, you're right, right, exactly. Oh, okay. Go ahead, man. Go ahead, man. Go ahead. Proverbs, Proverbs 5 and 5. Her feet go down to death. Her steps take hold on hell. Lest thou shouldest ponder the path of life, her ways are movable. Yeah, that's why these bitches, they take your asses on a highway to hell. <laughs> that's what you're going to do. That's why they like little demons. You know how these crazy ass bitches are? These bitches are nuts. And a lot of them too, they all crazy. The reason a lot of these women are so crazy because they done had so many men bust so many different nuts up in them. And every time, because that, that, that uh, destabilizes a, a woman's brain chemistry. I mean, it's a scientific fact. They done had scientists done prove that when a woman has multiple uh, different semen from different men in, up inside of her, it, it messes up the chemistry in her brain yeah. and it causes mood swings, causes depression, yeah. Yeah. causes there's insanity. Actual, right, there's an actual doctor on YouTube that's yeah, saying this. It, this ain't like us that. making it up. It says that it causes you my bitch. Yep, be sper yep, yep. It causes a, a sperm war, a, 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 like sperm be fighting inside their body. World War Three. And that's so why that's why these women are so emotional and so and they start going crazy. Right. And yeah. plus on top of that, a lot of them they get abortions, and abortions mess them up too. And a lot of times a doctor will chop up the baby and pull out the pieces. And they'll leave some pieces in there. She, she never know. Right. Hey, you be having like a yeah. finger or a toe up in you for like. <laughs> that's disgusting, but I would, I would be reading uh, reports about it uh, in the news all the time. About a woman uh, found out ten years later she still had a part of the fetus in her from when she had an abortion. Woo. I know it was a hell fucking that bitch, man. Uh, oh, my fault. Before you get that, bust all these hoes of drug addicts. Almost every, not just women, everybody. And a report came out that said over, uh, it said over 70% of Americans are hooked on uh, pharmaceutical drugs. They hooked on painkillers, oxycontins, codeine, what all the other shit they get, sell at the drugstore. <laughs> psychedelic drugs they take for uh, like for depression and shit. Oh, that's not counting the meth heads and the, the coke heads and mm. the heroin. Mm. You know? And all that shit in the rise. Crack. Heroin made a big comeback. Jeez. Oh. Heroin made a big comeback since the United States military been over there in Afghanistan. Oh, yeah. Ever since, ever since the United States went over there to Afghanistan, heroin increased. And they, they over there protect, they got videos on YouTube with Geraldo Rivera, where they showing you, it was on Fox News, where they show you that the, the Marines, the United States Marines was guarding poppy fields. And what they say, the heroin use went up like 2,000%? Some ridiculous percentage you're saying, man. That's good. It needs to go up even higher. Right, 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 right. We hope more of you motherfuckers stick a needle in your arm and drop dead. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. Right. Shoot your buddy up with you. You yeah. know, shoot him up first. Then you yeah. die of AIDS, too. Right. Because they used to spread AIDS when they, they shared needles. Yeah. yeah I've seen I people share needles before, too. I've seen some crazy shit in this world. Man. 
and we having some old rusted up nasty ass needles. Got their that, that spoons all nasty and dirty. That should be good, yeah. All about that high, they're supposed to be fucked up. That's a physical body. You, your body physically gets addicted. You crack is just a mental. We know what the same thing that's a heroin is in an oxycotton. Same shit. This is from the same goddamn plant. Same shit. Same shit. The sleeping mags, the heroin that thing. Like, yeah. uh, like, uh, uh, I can't even think of the name of it. Uh, damn. Uh, that's how they control these people. Because the government makes sure that everybody stays doped up on drugs and they, they fucking high out of their mind. When you take some oxycontins, are you shooting up heroin? You can't you can't operate on that shit, man. Walk. <laughs> what do you think happened to her? Look, she walking, she, her asshole got blown the fuck out. They just, you see that with these women all the time walking like that, man. Yeah, yeah, they done yeah. got the train ran on, they done shot a porno. The men walk like that too. Walking down like they just got their asshole blown out. You know they walk around with butt plugs in them just to keep your butt stretched. Yep. That's, That's nasty, what they do. Man. They walk around with it up there. These some foul ass people, man. These some ungodly people. These some ungodly ass people. These some goddamn heathens. <laughs> and Israel worse than real heathens. They're the worst. But since we talking about these trifling ass bitches, here's one, um, this is a, you finished with that? Yeah. Uh, this is Ecclesiastes 7 and 26. And I have found more bitter than death the woman whose heart is snares and nets. That's what the Bible has to say about you women. Keep going. In her hands, as bands, whoso pleaseth the most high shall escape from her. Like we uh, like we got all these captain save a hoes, they always trying to save a hoe. Falling in love with a hoe, you know what I mean? Like, like the old saying goes, you can't turn a hoe into a housewife, okay? Right, right, right. You can't do it. Yeah. Bitches with degrees and shit, they don't fuck their way through college. Yep. All these successful women got good jobs. The only reason they got that job is because they blew somebody off. These bitches are retarded. They can't have no skills. Yeah, we were just talking about that, too. It's not even about half the time what you do. Yeah, it is. It's all about who you know. You put it in. Who you fucking know. And actually, a lot of the men, they get, uh, they get a lot of the high positions for uh, blowing their boss off, too. Because now it's hard to get a good job unless you're a faggot. Right. Just like all them actors, everybody's all jealous. I want to be a famous actor too. Well, guess what? If you want to be a famous actor, you gotta go get the producer a blowjob. Yeah, join the. That's the yeah. casting couch. Yeah, that's the casting couch. That's what this When he fucking rapes you in your asshole. Hey, these big people are willing for that, man. They, that's they a, actually that's look a small to it. price to pay for success. That's how these people look at it. Yeah, just small price yeah. to pay. just yeah. like all these jakes in the hood who dream of being a rapper. Now, like it. it the information's out there that you gotta sell out to be a rapper. Most people know that now. They know about Jay-Z being in the Illuminati. Yeah, yeah. They know about Kanye West being in the Illuminati. Yeah, yeah. So they still in the back of their mind, they, they, they can't wait to sell their soul to the devil and to become a rapper. And they thinking, I, I only gotta suck that dick or once or twice and yeah. I'll be good with it. I can just, you know. Some of them do it and just like it. Right, they like it. LL. Uh, yeah. Dr. Dre. Dr. Dre. Will Smith. Will Smith. Uh, yeah, yeah. Denzel Washington. Michael Jordan. <laughs> These motherfuckers like it. You know, they used to do a lot of sucking and getting fucked. Now they fuck it. They, they rose up the ladder, the pyramid, so yeah, to say. Yeah, they rose up You know? Now they get <laughs> Now they getting blown off. Yeah. Like LeBron is probably blowing Michael now. Yeah, yeah. They, and they yeah, like to, you know? they really like to get your ass at a young Damn, age. Man. Well, they like to rape children more than anything. Right. That's why they get all these little child stars. They be raping them. You see what happened to that little Macaulay Culkin from Home Alone? Remember that oh, yeah. little dude? They look like they raped the shit out of him. They, they, they him you and see the uh, Corey Feldman. Corey yeah. Yeah, oh yeah, you, your boy Corey Feldman, he got a book out. He's talking about how uh, 
when him and Corey Feldman was making movies back in the 80s, and they was like, they was like young kids was or whatever. Shit back then. But they said they was getting molested, they was getting raped. They was getting drugged and raped yeah. by they, their they, producers and they shit. They put that on their TV show. You know they had a little TV show, <laughs> yeah. um, reality TV show. <laughs> they put that shit in there because they, because the they got all emotional and shit. <laughs> He's like, where was you when I was getting raped? Yeah, yeah. yeah on yeah, national yeah, TV, y'all yeah. seen that shit? I mean, what? Yeah, they I was, they was, that shit. I seen that. You seen that? The funny thing is, they, they was like, shit. they was liking that shit back then. But you know, Israelites got a conscience like yeah. a motherfucker. Sorry, get to him. You know, years well, you, go on. Well, you one dude, Corey Haim, he uh, he pretty much. Took a bunch of drugs that he probably pretty much the probably killed himself. Took the coke with that yeah. shit. That's he why he dropped dead from my overdose. <laughs> I mean, I, I'd fucking kill myself too if I got raped. Because Corey Phil, man, I seen him in the movie back in the day, uh, Lost Boys. Yeah, was yeah. Lost, Boys? Lost Boys? Both yeah. of them was in Lost yeah, they Boys. Both was in, and, and in the movie Lost Boys, he had like he ain't had a little feminine spirit with in the, that movie. Lost Boys yeah, with yeah, That's what that vampire shit, like, movie. Yeah, that vampire movie with uh, Kiefer Sutherland. But they raped the shit out of them little bastards. Yeah, I don't remember that. That's why I got Kiefer Sutherland in it. Yeah, Kiefer Sutherland, uh, Corey Haim. Corey Feldman. Yeah, yeah but that, that's proof. So, you, so people can't say we're making this stuff up. We tell you, look, if you want to be a famous actor, you got you to gotta take it up the ass. Well, we're not making that up. That's a fact. I said, they work, they were their devil yeah, worship. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Picking up the ass. You can look up that shit too. Yeah, I mean, Corey Feldman. Right, they, they admit it. He got a book out on it. Yeah. United yeah. States of Sodom. That's what this place is. A nation of sodomites. Bunch of fucking it is, weirdos. It is foul. Yeah, they, they actually protect faggot rights. If you beat up a faggot, if you beat someone up, if you call them a faggot while you're fighting somebody, <laughs> they'll call that a hate crime. Yep. Turn into a federal offense. That, 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 that won't make no damn sense. If you if you go over across the street right now and smoke one of these heater mics, that's a hate crime. Man, actually, they should. If the cops seen a faggot, they should beat the shit out of them on the spot. Faggots, like, faggots get together and jump on you, and that way won't be a hate crime. Right. Yeah, ain't that about it? But they're protected. Look at this. Uh, he, who the fuck are you wearing a grandma? A on. Wearing a grandma a shirt. shit. On. Fucking weirdos, man. He's wearing like a grandma blouse. That's I thought you was talking about Kurt Cobain. Oh, where? Uh, Kurt, Kurt, what? Kurt Cobain. Kurt Cobain. <laughs> They, 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 they look at this nigga. They looking at the wall like it's a movie. They might be some musicians or something. You got a concert going down here, so you probably probably musicians out here and shit. Walk around high out their mind. Yeah, you know how it's going. Stone on acid. Yeah, I was watching. On acid. I was watching Trailer Park Jesus yesterday. <laughs> that's a funny ass Trailer movie. Trailer Park man. Jesus. I've yeah, it's a that. funny ass movie, man. Yeah, that's the Newport down there. You ever been to the Newport? Oh, no, I didn't oh, know yeah, you see, you see where that sign is? Yeah. They got concerts down there all the time. Big names be down there too, mostly heavy metal and shit. Now they got rap groups too and shit though, don't they? Well, back in the day they used to have more shit going down, going on down there. Yeah. But now it's not too much of a wide variety, it's just one type of music. They, like this shit the college people listen to. They garbage, I don't even know there. what the fuck they listen to. Yeah, they're creepy music. They, they don't even like none of this new music. Yeah, okay. But back in the day, in the 90s, man, it was all kind of shit going on down there. You know? Music nowadays, they always put some weird ass language in it. What's up, man? You know you're an Israelite? Hell no. Oh, he, 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 he probably think he's doing smart. Man, he ain't smart shit. Smart shit. The scriptures say the fear of the Lord is the beginning of knowledge, but fools despise wisdom and destruction. That's, right. That's Proverbs 1 and 7. That is what you just about to read. I was still in uh, GTS 7. Oh, yeah. Go ahead. Okay, go. Um, and her hands as bands, whoso pleaseth the most high shall escape from her. Let's talk about these wicked ass hoes. Okay? A real man of the Lord is not going to, uh, is not going to got, get got by a hoe. Have a hoe, uh, get his ass. You know what I'm saying? Run right. game on you. If the Lord is dealing with you, you, you ain't you ain't gonna have me nobody none of these hoes running game on you. No. you but, know the, what I'm right. but the sinner shall be taken by her. Because a lot of you weak brother, like a lot of these weak bro brothers, I don't call them brothers, but they get they get seduced by these wicked ass women. They just they just all they care about is getting a piece of pussy. They, and then when they fuck one of these wicked ass women, they fall in love with her. 
You know what I mean? They calling her, texting her every two minutes, obsessed with her. And, and then the hoes just running game on you, man. That's right. Just using your ass, man. Just got doing all here. that, doing all that. Uh, motherfucking stressing over yeah, that Yeah, stressing, bitch. losing sleep over a bitch. She fucking something You over here dreaming about this hoe. <laughs> you know, crying and shit. Oh, hey, man, I love you, I love her. I can't believe she cheated on me, but I still love her. Right, I right. I forgive her. Right. I didn't have some dumb ass shit on the radio going on Valentine's Day. They actually had the couple calling in on the radio. And this nigga was on there all up this bitch's ass apologizing to her because, you know, it was Valentine's Day. I guess he did something to make her mad. So, you know, it was Valentine's Day. They both called a radio station so he could make amends. This bitch put him on blast horribly on, on, on the on radio. radio. That's fucked up. That's how these hoes, these hoes got no decency, and he was, man. And he was, and he was no, apologizing, no, no, no. saying, I'm sorry, you know, no. whatever. They get these hoes on camera right here, just look at a little example. No. They walking down half damn naked, I can see right up these bitches' skirts. When well, you finish oh. celebrating Thomas on this day, they still going. Look, you can see nothing but leg when these hoes are wild, you see nothing but leg. Okay, that's a sign of some hoes. Women ain't supposed to wear, when a woman wears a dress, first of all, women ain't supposed to wear pants, they are supposed to wear a dress. And a long one at that. Not those fucking mini skirts where I can see your goddamn pussy. Right, 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 right. Fucking And then they wonder why we talk like that. Like, I wanna fuck this hoe. Like, look at this bitch. But I can see everything. I see your ass. What do you think I wanna. You can't help but look at that, you know what I mean? Yeah. We do look for we, we like women. We do like women. You know? We like some women. Especially one with a body. But we don't like no hoes. Hell yeah. Some shit that just got niggas uh, doing some bukkake. What's that called? And the bukkake? Yeah, she got the bukkake, uh, the, the bukkake face lotion on her. <laughs> 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 right, right. Some Caligula lotion. You're right. 30, 40 niggas dumping loads on a bitch's face, man. That's the They'll do that at lunchtime just to make a quick check, paycheck. Yep, you know yep. what I mean? Yep. And they don't get paid much for that porn either, man. They probably just get a couple hundred, maybe. Yeah, there's like a, only a few of them that make real good money. Yeah. They're the nastiest of the yeah, nasty. Yeah, they're nasty. They all got diseases. They, they say that, they talk, in the porn industry, all kind of people catching AIDS. There's like an HIV epidemic breaking out in the porn industry. <laughs> good for them. And I